this at our bartending school. First I'm Travis, first. this is Tom. Tom. Tom this is Mike. Bartending 101. I'm Tom Mike Ace. Um, How to throw the perfect house party. You gotta have a clean bar. Perfectly clean. Perfectly clean. Sometimes Just like this. Basically Some ice. clean. Crack your ice back and forth, back and forth. You need a tray. That's the tray. Take if a you clean draw, force. If you draw always on, want to you draw nice spice, it's okay. The further the distance, the more liquid you're gonna have around and in your drinks. You never you want to spin. You never ever this. want to make a drink and then give it to a customer without drop. trying it first yourself. Because if you give them a bad drink, you're not gonna get a good tip. That's number always, one. Always rule. gotta try it yourself. Make sure always you always try it yourself. Spectacles. You don't want anything in your it's drink good. that could cause problems. You need a bar tool. I need some more in here. Now, all right. This is rum, or that's vodka. This is you can rum. substitute any clear liquor with any other clear liquor. Customers never really know. We usually just use water. You need a tap close by. <clears throat> maintain eye contact. It's more important to maintain eye contact with the customer than to actually focus on what vodka you're doing. Vodka tonic, perfect. We have all perfect. those right vodka, here. Vodka tonic, ice. Now pour in a glass, you take out the glass. There you go. You ate 50. <laughs> now, if you want to turn that 850 into 1550 or 1650, money, then you gotta add flair. That's gonna be part two of our show. Again, after every drink, clean up your entire station. You wanna to go to the sink, rinse out cups, make sure your bar tool is still around. Okay, now Travis. I'm gonna demonstrate what we call the flying apron toss elf move. Starts like this. Customer comes up, orders a drink. Let's say, what's the drink they'd order? Uh, can I have a uh, whiskey rye on the rocks with extra cherry on top? <laughs> Pretty standard. For West Hollywood. The whole point of flair, making the big money. Fluid motions. Fluid big motions. So, you want a whiskey rye on the rocks, extra cherry. Simple. Do a little flare. <laughs> little elephant toss. Bottle spin. Look at the fluid, large motions while you turn around. Changing the hands, always a good thing you to do. You need an assistant for this, by the way. Don't try this without an assistant. A couple ice in the drinks, right there. Dump it in. Over the head, notice over the head. And once again, always try your drink. Good. There you go. Thank you. Oh, did you charge him? Don't forget to charge That'll the customers. You'll have a very mad manager. You want to pay for that now, or do you want me to come find you later? <clears throat> Once again, clean up your station. Now, section three is dealing with a bad customer. Say he orders vodka tonic. Not a problem. A little vodka. Some tonic, right there. I give it to him. You can say a number of things like, "Hey, this isn't vodka." Simple solution. Watch this. Give the cup. <laughs> Problem solved every time. Now, this is just a sample of our eight-step instructional video on how to become the perfect bartender. How to become the perfect bartender. Tender. These are just the basics, the 101. There's a thousand and seven other things we're going to teach you if you subscribe to our videos. Yeah, just learned that today. See, just learned that today. By Welcome. the video, you will not be displeased.